What's going on everybody? Batman1999 here and today we are going to be showing off my figure collection. We're going to be showing off my Funko Pops as well as the figures in these boxes, figures displayed, and the figures on the walls as well as just a couple of things around the room. Let's get started. I'm ready to show you guys and can't wait to show you some of these things. If you want me to review anything you see in this video, like, subscribe, comment down below what you want me to review. And if you guys are offering anything for sale, if it if I don't say it's for sale, it's not for sale. So pretty much I probably won't put up anything for sale in this video. So I'm going to go ahead and say that. Don't put in the comments down below, are you wanting to sell this? So the things that I'm going to review are the things that I'm not going to review, I also will say in this video. Let's go ahead and get started. we got a lot to cover. Let's go ahead and start right here in front of us. We have my um, custom snowy figure, and he is standing on top of a piece of... What is this? Oh, yeah, I drew a picture. It was uh, Star Wars versus Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I love drawing that picture. There is my Lego General Grievous. I love this Grievous figure. Love this right here, too. These are my two Deadpool Pops. This is my X-Man Deadpool and my regular Deadpool. This right here is my flashlight. And then this right here was in my uh, car show video, so if you haven't seen that, or my car show haul video, so if you haven't seen that, uh, be sure to check that out. Uh, this is my Funko Pops Ride Deadpool, my Funko Pops Ghostbusters car with Winston Zedmore. My 66 Batman, um, Batmobile and Batman, my Dewback, and my Sand, my Sand Trooper. Here's my Grievous. And then we got my uh, TARDIS here. Then we got my box for my Ant-Man figure. I need, I'll show you guys that here in just a minute. There's my Rocketeer Legacy figure from Funko. 2099 Spider-Man. There's my Legends Ant-Man as well. As some of my Hulkbuster build a figure series figures. There's Vision, Doctor Strange, then there's Blizzard, War, uh, War Machine, then there's my Edgar Bug from my Men in Black figures. And then we got that right there, which is my new Iron Man. Then we got my Hawkeye here, my 1 6 scale Disney Adventures Tarzan. We got my piggy bank, which actually makes noise. Cool, right? I am the creepy human cyborg relation, and this is my counterpart, R2D2. Now, then we got my Superhero Masters, Luke Skywalker, Darth Vader 2 pack set, the entire trilogy of the Star Wars series. Uh, this is episode 6, 7, and 8, or no, 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 this is episode 4, 5, and 6, and I love these. That's my Marvel Select Deadpool, I need to review him, but there's my uh, NECA Terminator, my Snake Plissken, there's my Ash Williams, and these are retro cloths, these are both from NECA as well, there is my um, Star Wars, um, Force Awakens, Ray, Kylo Ren, and my Stormtrooper. Or yeah, and then we got Obi Wan. There's the box for Han Solo. There's my armored Batman, and back there is the Wolf Jim Carrey mask. There's my plush Homer Simpson that actually speaks. I was once like you. And love that Homer. There's my custom Snowy again. There's my Diecast Lightning McQueen. I need to get Mater to go with him. And there is my le uh, my legendary Yoda, which will never come out of the packaging. So don't even ask, guys, if I'm going to review this. One of you guys will be a smart elk and do it. Back there is my Funko Pop keychains. Like, well, I got to be careful with some of this stuff because it's like barely balanced. So let's go ahead and let's scoot that back. <laughs> And Tarzan's a pain in the butt to get to stand up. I'll stand him back up later. But back there is pretty much just a keychain of an adipose. There's a keychain of Chucky. And there's Jason. 
and then right there is the keys to a vehicle um, and then right there is my Marvel Legends Daredevil I love this Daredevil figure I apologize for that guys continuing on I'll go over these guys later in the review there's my big stormtrooper right there. I love that stormtrooper figure. I love all these figures personally. I mean, I mean, I wouldn't have them if I didn't love them. But right there is my big poster of my Marvel characters. I just love all these figures overall. And like I said, there's the Disney Adventures one six scale Tarzan. Love Tarzan though. Tarzan's one of my favorite figures I have. But uh Moving over here, we have my hodgepodge of Legos. This is a bunch of pieces. If you guys want me to review this thing, let me know in the comments down below. I really don't know if I want to, but I love this thing. And I, I kind of want to in a way, but in a way I don't. But, uh, yeah. It's got a uh, crane up here. And then right here has got the cutter. There's my Captain America watch, as well as my Hot Wheels um, Batman vehicles. There's his jet and bike and car and other car and his other car. But here's a good look at all my figures. Take a good look at those for a minute. I love these figures. I love every one of them in their own unique ways. Then right there is my Hair Jordan Air Jordan hat. There's my Michael, well, not Michael Bay, but uh, my Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles hat. And here's my turtles. I got Donatello, Leonardo, Raphael, and Michelangelo. These are the Bay Turtles. There's a scented thing. And there's my gigantic Darth Vader. He's kind of a hat holder right now, so that one piece of articulation where he can move his arm out is actually being put to use right now at the moment. So Vader's going to have to work due to the fact he's tried to take over the galaxy. So, let's go ahead and look in these boxes here. Um, the last two boxes I'm not going to really open. Um, this one right here is my 6-inch scale figures. i got Syndrome in there. Right there he is. There's Megamind. I love Megamind. And then, like, there's Thor, Human Torch, General Zod, Ant-Man. There's another Iron Man. There's Gru, Aquaman, Deadpool. I love this Deadpool figure. And I finally got Minion. So there he is. Uh, um, on Solo, Captain America's right there. That's my 6-inch drawer. Um, then here's my 7-inch drawer. It's my NECA. Um, yeah, uh, Robocop. And his leg actually opens. I'm not going to do that right now, though. There's my Wolverine. There's my Diamond Select, or Marvel Select. Iron Man. This is the Mark 42. There's my Ninja Turtles. There's my John Cena. It's Legolas. There's another turtle. That's Kick-Ass. Love my Kick-Ass figure. Oh yeah, and then this is my custom death figure. This is like Grim Reaper. That's my custom death figure. I made that. There's a creature from Black Lagoon. Tarzan. Tron. Tron actually speaks. got that from Mookie Mars years ago. Then up here in the top drawer is my Marvel Select comic version of the Incredible Hulk. And you got a lizard here. You got Buzz Lightyear. I love my Buzz. I wondered where that thing was. It was in this drawer. I wondered if it was in my 6, six inch drawer or 7 inch drawer. And then there's my Thing figure. There's Spock right there. You can see his arm. And some Lord of the Rings figures. There's Ben 10, Lord of mercy, Ben 10. You've been through a lot, buddy. I've had this thing since I was like four, though, whenever the first the show first came out, though. So he's had some love. And then, like, there's a horn swoggle. Oh, yeah, and then there's another Spider Man at Moki Mars, and I traded it's from the first one. Um, the seven inch drawer, five inch drawer. This is pretty much the basic five inch figures R2D2, uh, Shrek. I've got uh, Robocop there. I've got a Tarantula, Shredder. I've got some TMNT figures in here. There's the mask from Jim Carrey. There's Sid the Sloth from Ice Age. i got a little bit of everything, guys. Last drawer I'm going to show off is my uh, 3.75-inch scale figures. 
I love my Men in Black figures, though. I'm going to show these guys right here next to the Edgar Bug. Yes, I love my Men in Black figures. Okay, let's go ahead and look at the Funko Pops. But I'm going to show you guys this play set right here. This is the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle set. Um, this is kind of a just a, a desk, really, for me. I just throw everything on here. Um, I got my phone up there plugged up right now. I've got a little HTC. I've got it plugged up. Let's go ahead and move over to the uh, shelf with my Funko Pops. There's my Deadpool poster. I love this poster. There's my certificate of appointment from the Newport City Council. Um, then we got my Wolverine uh, picture there. We got my uh, Batmobile picture from the car show. Okay, let's go ahead and get the Funko Pops reviewed, though. This is the very first of the movies line. I'm going to go in these in line. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. Jason Voorhees is at number one. Um, Freddy Krueger's at number two. Beetlejuice is five. Robocop's 22. Alien and Predator is 30 and 31. Ash is number 53. So for Army of Darkness, it's 53. Chucky is at number 56. I need to get uh, Toothless to go with Hiccup. Uh, Hiccup is at number 95. Um, Hook Fang is at number 98. I need to get Astrid as well. Barf and Belch is at 99. Peter Vankman, from, this is my Ghostbusters. Peter Vankman is at number 104. Uh, Ray Stance is at 105. Egon Spangler is at 106. And Ricky Bobby is at 183. I need to get Cal to go with him. And then we got Ted at number 187. Moving on, we have Funko Pop Heroes. And we have the Joker at number 53. Moving on, a very expensive Funko Pop. He costed about $55. So if you guys are looking for this one, he's going to be hard to find. Master Chief is part of a gaming uh, series. He's at number 3. Ezio is at number 21 for Assassin's Creed. Connor's at 22. Edward is at 23. Love God of War. Kratos is my favorite uh, at number 25. I only have one Star Wars pop, which is Boba Fett, and he is at number 8. I got Wolverine here starting off my Marvel collection. I've got him at number five. The Mark 42 Iron Man from Iron Man 3 is at number 23. My Guardians of the Galaxies, here we go. Um, Star Lord's at 47. Rocket's at 48. Groot is at 49. Drax is at 50. And Gamora is at 51. We have television here. And Funko Pop Television, I need to get Patrick to go with you. Uh, pa uh, SpongeBob is at number 25. Rigby from Regular Show is at 46. Mordecai is at 47. Need to get the rest of the Turtles to go with Raph. Raph is at number 61, and we got the Hold Up Dynasty set here. We got number 77 for Willie. Uncle Si is at number 78. Jace is number 79, and Phil is 80. And we have our last three of the television, which is J uh, Jax Teller at 88, and the 10th Doctor at 21, and the Adipose at 20, uh, 120, 225. Big thanks to Mom1978 for these two. We got John Cena here for WWE at number one. And we have Stitch here for 12 for the Disney. Now, this is starting for Disney. Uh, Stitch is 12. Wally is 45. Roger Rabbit is 103. And Lilo is 124. There's a good look at my Star Wars poster. Coming back over here, we have Nick Wilde at 186 and Judy Hopps at 189 for our Disney and starting animation out, we have Mr. Peabody and Sherman at eight, uh, number seven and eight, and we have Peter Griffin at one uh, at thirty-one. And here we have the entire complete set of the Disney Adventures figures for the six-inch scale. We have Peter Pan here. We have Hercules, Tarzan, personal favorite, and we got Aladdin along with Captain Hook. They really should have done more than just Captain Hook as the only villain in the set. Really should have done more. Like I'd like to see Clayton, Hades, and possibly um, Jafar. That would have been a really cool set. We got Freddy here, along with the skull. We got some stop motion sets. Uh, this is the Batman play school thing. And then we got uh, the Pirates of the Caribbean Black Pearl ship. And I got the accessories that go there. I got a pirate or a castle. And then all these in these boxes is mostly movies, Nerf stuff, cosplay, and all sorts of other stuff. They're snowy there along with my uh, cosplay clown outfit, my ROTC uniform. There's some other pictures from me from 2004, 5, 5, and there is me and the muffler man, as well as my mom when she was younger and me as a baby. So if you guys wondered what I looked like as a baby, 
there's my face as a baby. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Let's go ahead and move on to the next thing, which is signing off. One other thing, though, I wanted to show off my Ash Williams cosplay chainsaw. I love this thing to death. If you guys want me to do anything cosplay related, like make something, let me know in the comments down below and I will try my best. Okay, guys, that's pretty much it for this video. If you like this video, please let me know in the comments down below. And nothing here is for sale. I have officially decided this. And if you guys want me to tell you what that is for, I will tell you guys later if you let me know in the comments down below you want to hear what it's for. That's pretty much it. That's all my collection. If you like my collection, please sure to like, subscribe, comment down below. Let me know what you think. Uh, be sure to check out my friend Jeremy and on Entertainment, the Inferior Ghost, Blue Ninja Gamer. I will explain his channel later. I keep forgetting the name. And Swifty Empire. That's it for this video, guys. If you like my collection, let me know what your favorite figure was. My personal favorite, it's really hard to pick. Um, it would really just depend. But that's it for this video, guys. Like this video, like, subscribe, comment down below. Peace.